I can't physically do a BLJ because my hands won't let me do it. So that, I guess that's that. I can't do that trick. I can't. I'm never gonna be able to save those six seconds because I can't do it. My hands don't let me do it. So that's that. I'm gonna go ahead and erase that gold because I'm never gonna do that HMC. I'm never gonna do that BLJ ever again. I can't do it. That shirt was way too easy to rip as well. I didn't expect that to happen. A button. I don't know why. <sighs> I've spent years going back and forth with that trick. Stressing myself out. So much stress has been centered around the HMC BLJ star. And going back and forth whether or not I should do this. Shall I do that? Shall I learn this trick? Shall I not? And then complaining that my hands won't let me do the BLJ. And I can't do the BLJ. I can't. I just drop the BLJ all the time. And I think that I think that was the final straw. I think that was the final straw. It makes me feel good because that's the final straw. I think that's the final straw of accepting the fact that I just can't do it. It's a trick that I can't do. And that's that. Like, it's not that big of a deal. I need to stop being jealous of other runners being able to do it. And I can't do it. I just have to accept that I can't do it. And I can still get world record. And that's that. That's that. Damn, that was one of my favorite shirts. Easily one of my favorite. I might have to buy a new one. Rip shirt. It was a good shirt, man. That clip is going to be legendary, though. Uh, that clip is probably going to be remembered for, like, the rest of my streaming career. It's going to be another one of those, like, uh, the runs over clips. It's just content for you guys. Like, I, I did it on purpose. I did not do that on purpose. I had no idea that was going to happen until it happened. Can I just point out, I got like five subs since I ripped my shirt. I should do that more often. Now I know why people do stupid things on their streams and YouTube videos. Oh my god. <laughs> oh boy. I'm a lot more physical in my rages since I've started playing the game again. Which I'm kind of surprised about. I thought I'd be less physical. I think, I'm, I think it's just because I'm less afraid of actually raging now. I'm less afraid. I don't care what people think anymore. So I just get it out of the way. I think before I used to try to hide it more. I think pants are way harder to rip than shirts. Can you imagine that? Like a world where mooning somebody is like the substitute of middle finger. Instead of middle finger meaning like fuck you. It was mooning somebody. Like it would be regular for people to just like moon somebody real quick. To mean like fuck off. Like, mooning is just a regular thing on the street. <laughs> I would love to moon you guys, trust me. But I can't. Talking about mooning, I had a weird dream last night. That's the end of that story. Kitty? What was that? Do I have two cats in my room? I just heard a weird noise. That was not my cat. But I thought it was my cat, but she didn't move. Hey. Hey. Hey! Oh, quick. No, no, no. Don't, don't, don't come here. No, don't. Oh, fuck. Stay there. Don't distract me. <laughs> Shit. I accidentally called her. Now she's coming to harass me. The cat Ming. <laughs> Guys! I don't know why I'm just playing like shit balls. Are you the twink from Canada, Noah? Am I fucking gay? I'm just normal gay. I'm not fucking gay. Hell yeah! I'm ugly. Wait, I don't need to be good looking to be gay. Bye, Jaden. Thank God. <laughs> See you never. Bye! <laughs> I need- What? Wait, wait, I didn't get it. I actually didn't get it. Huh? Dumb face activated. I wish that I had- uh, What I need to do is like have that ment a strong mentality where like if I'm done doing runs for the night or done trying for the night, then I would do one more run that is a no reset run and just finish it no matter what for practice. I, that would be like ideal because I get a, a practice. I get practice every time. Oh, 
She dropped me off hot chocolate. Look at that. How amazing is my grandmother? She made a hot chocolate for me. I've been revived. Now I can do runs for like five more hours. Ooh, way too hot. Holy shit. You seen I ripped my shirt? Uh that's a good question. She tried to burn me. To scheme all along. How come no more 05? Because Law Lamal rot full from foliation. That's why. Am I no longer 14? <laughs> yeah, good one. Oh yeah, it's a kitty mug. That's true. But in the end, doesn't it move away? Hey. Okay, that is a little bit ridiculous that I just did that. That is a little bit fucking ridiculous that I just did that, man. My favorite kind of cheese, dick cheese. Alright guys, one more star and we've finished the entire run. Oh wait. Star number nine. It's a beautiful star, Aquarium. Very simple star, but uh, gets you going. It teaches you a lot about swimming, so you can get prepared for GRB. Very nice scenery. Cool concept. Boring as fuck, but pretty cool nonetheless. As you can see, Mario is farting constantly. Hence the bubbles, and helps him go faster. It's his, it's his secret weapon. His bubble farts. Uh, the jet stream, all you have to do is not miss a swim. You just need to swim with the right rhythm. This rhythm that I'm swimming with now. And you would get through the jet stream very easily. It's just to develop the, cons the consistent rhythm of swimming. You can hear it too. You can hear when he does the fast one and when he does the slow one. There's a clear distinction. Ooh, using big words. That sound is like the fast swim. When you just hear the boom, 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 that's the slow swim. That means you fucked up. And when you only hear that, that means you're fucking up every time. <laughs> that's when you know you have to change your rhythm. Where's the fridge from? It's just my thing. Welcome to the fridge, because cheese and food and stuff. Like, literally a pixel higher, and that would not have worked. Damn. 3,000 bits away from the bits badge of true financial irresponsibility. I think I'm gonna go for it. I. Yeah, I'm not surprised, Dan. And it just made me laugh when you said the irresponsibility part, because... Because it's you. What is the bad? Do you have yet the green one? What is after? Is it the the yellow one? Is it the one hundred thousand badge? Dan, are you almost at a hundred thousand? Because I'll be insane. I think it is. Oh my god! You are talking about the one hundred thousand badge. That's that is that is like the that's the highest badge that anyone in my chat has. I think. Oh my god! Oh god! What have I done? He did it. He has the 100k badge. Welcome to the club, babe. Congrats on your badge, loving. Thank you so much for that, though. I appreciate it. Hopefully I can do well in this run for you. This is my last run of the day, though, so... Um, I'm just gonna try to relax and not scream or cry or break shirts. R break. Rip shirts. I'm gonna try to rip my pants instead. Especially after those bits. Whoa. Chain Chomp almost chained my all chomps. Badu, Badu. Koopa just wants to kiss me in the mouth. I knew it. Where are we? Whoa. whoa. Yeah, but that juicy jump, that juicy, 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 juicy booty though. Oh my god. I lost all my times. I lost 14 seconds to my gold. 15 almost. Almost 15 seconds. And th that was a flawless BOB. I didn't make a single mistake. I didn't make a single technical error in that BOB. And I lost almost 15 seconds. Oh my god. The run's dead. Rip. 
I should have kept going, but it doesn't make sense. Rip. I mean, technically speaking, it's kind of dead for world record too, because like, if I continued that run and got world record, I would have gotten an unverified world record again, and no, <laughs> I don't want that again. Oh. 